for Lord Damien here and welcome to another reaction. Today we're about to react to Stranger Things Season 3 Teaser Trailer number 1. I am excited. I am a huge fan of Stranger Things as you all know. If you have been watching my previous videos, you know that I did make a review of Stranger Things Season 2. Uh, I thought it was great. I loved the first season, really enjoyed it. It's probably one of my favorite show on Netflix. Despite on what you're seeing right now with my headphones on this, uh, with this microphone, this thing is not fucking working. My apologies, it does not work. So in this video, things might get loud, so my apologies for that. And as you can hear, it's fucking raining. Earth, America, Indiana, Hawkins. A growing patriotic community and a shining example of the American dream. Today, Hawkins is taking another step into the future with the brand new Star Court Mall. Families, friends, and of course, teenagers can come together to shop, hang out, dine, and enjoy. With retail options for every member of the family, including the Gap, Walden Books, and Sam Goodman. Starcourt Mall has it all. Has it all. <laughs> and don't forget, a state-of-the-art food court. Just an escalator ride away, featuring America's favorite place to cool down. Scoops Ahoy Ice Cream Shop. <laughs> Ahoy! Starcourt Mall is one of the oh, finest shopping facilities in America and beyond. Uh, this, so this come on down and remember, Starcourt Mall has it all. Starcourt is an all-American subsidiary of Starcourt Industries and International Enterprise. Okay, that's it. The marketing on this reminds me of um, X-Men Apocalypse, uh, which is also set in the 80s. I remember one commercial where Jubilee is talking about the school and how the look of it is, you know, 80s and stuff. So it reminded me of that. I think the girl next to Steve is probably his new love interest. By the way, uh, Stardust, I guess? Is, is that what it's called? Star Starcourt. Yeah, Starcourt. Starcourt reminds me of the mall from Fast at Much More High. Yeah, I did watch that. I thought it was fine. I didn't really thought it was that much of a good film, but yeah, I thought it was fine. I think they're very homage to it. I mean, the Dumber Brothers are, you know, essentially a huge fan of 80s. Pretty much we all know that. So, yeah, I can see that it's paying homage to Fast Times at Richmond High. Although I felt bad for Steve, though. I think he's having a rough time right now. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, I'm excited for Season 3. Uh, I'm, I'm really excited for season 3. I heard that they kind of time jump a little bit. This is set after two years or one, I don't know. So, again, I'm excited. I, I, I love Stranger Things. Uh, but I was already a fan of the 80s before I watched Stranger Things. I was already a fan of the 80s. My parents, you know, let me watch one of, the, one of their childhood films. E.T., Goonies, back to of course and a lot more and also I am also a fan of the, uh, the Cartoon Network TV show regular show uh, and it's also a uh, very homage to the 80s and it's a cool show love it so yeah that's what I that's all I can say so anyway guys thank you guys for watching this video please leave a like comment and if you're new to the channel please subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos of mine and click, I think, the bell right next to subscribe if you want to get notified. And if you want to see more videos like this one, please subscribe to my channel and have a lovely regular day.